Hey guys, it's Taku. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Today I'm going to haul all of the K-pop related merch, albums, things like that since the uh, beginning of the year. Uh, some stuff trickled in at the end of 2021. So we've got the end of 2021 and then up and through all of January. And without further ado, let's go ahead and just start with some of these albums. I figure that this is going to be an easier way to share things with you guys because I don't know. It just seems like it's easier to put everything in one video instead of making separate unboxings for everything. Let me know your preferred format. But the first thing is in Hyphen's Dimension Dilemma. And this is the uh, Scylla version. And it's very beautiful purple. It's so pretty in person. I'm not going to lie. I was kind of skeptical on whether I liked the album design to begin with. But uh, I'm just going to very briefly whoops, um, show you the like inclusions, I guess, that I got in this. And... The one that I got was the Nikki poster, which is really cool. Um, Nikki's not my favorite member. Uh, my bias is Jung Won, and then I also bias record Jake. So in case you know my hype and stuff, but I also love Sung Hoon. I love all of them actually. Like I'm, I'm just not a picky person when it comes to in hype and stuff. And it's got a cool little lyric flip book. And I, yeah, I'm doing a horrible job. This is obviously not an unboxing of any kind, but I just wanted to show you that I did haul this and my two photo cards were Jay and Nikki and the Nikki one is hollow so yeah not my two favorite members but I'm not complaining so there is this one and then I also got in hyphen's uh, newest album their newest comeback which is I believe dimension answer yes and this is the no version my sister got the uh, it's not yes, it's something else. But she got the other version of the album, and this one comes in a nice box, which is really cool. And this is the photo book. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I need to spend, honestly, probably more time looking through this all. But here is the disc here, and all of the inclusions. Again, I'm pretty much just going to flash through these, so I'm so sorry. But it came with this fold-out of, it's like a map. Kind of of their story type thing and there's this pop out thing not really sure and this one which i believe is a stand and sticker sheet as well as three individual member things the first is this kind of translucent uh card i don't know it's like a film type thing but i got jay again so my luck with jay i just think it's hilarious and then i got my bias record i got jake and that made me so happy, made it really worth pulling it. And then for the Polaroid, I got Sung, And I'm also not complaining because I got Sung stuff in the past before. So it's funny how I seem to keep pulling the same members for in hyphen. So there is all of that. The next thing I've got is Ghost Nine's album. And normally I do Ghost Nine unboxings. I'm so sorry, guys. But this is uh, now who... Um, let me get it right now who we are facing and this is their latest one I think it's the last one in the now series but this is the departure I never made a video about it at least I don't think I can't remember but Dong Joon is no longer in the group as well as uh, Taesung they are no longer in Ghost 9 so they're like seven members now and honestly it hits so hard because uh, you guys will know that Dong Joon is my bias for this group, and honestly, he always will be. Uh, but right now, I'll have to take Jin Woo and Jung Hung. Oh, by the way, this fencing concept, that is absolutely legendary. I knew I had to get this album just based off of the fencing concept. But anyway, um, yeah, he's no longer in the group. He's doing his own solo things, and I wish him the best, honestly, because he was such a great singer, great dancer, great, honestly, great on the stage. And so it's just really sad when a member leaves a group, especially when it's your bias. It just hurts, but we can only send them off with happy smiles. And so I'm like smiling through the tears. But everything I got in here, there is the Glee's calendar. It's like their cartoon mascot handout type thing, which just has some really like cool images, I believe from Seoul. But we've also got a sticker sheet for it, an individual member uh, pinup type thing. It's like a stand. And I got Shin, which honestly, legend. I love Shin's look for this comeback. Freaking killed it. And then there is the postcard, and I'm so glad I got the fencing one. I don't know if they're different, but I got the fencing one, and that's all that matters. And I got so lucky. 
with a individual member sticker sheet of Lee Jin Woo. And I got Jin Woo's photo card. And so I'm so happy because yeah, Jin Woo was my second favorite and he is the bias of Ghost 9. Or not bias. Yes, he's my bias of Ghost 9, but he's also the maknae. He is the youngest. And I never thought I'd bias a maknae, but here we are. So this made up for it. But yeah, it's really sad um, that they're not in that group anymore. And I still support their music. Control is an absolute hit of a song and y'all should go stream Ghost 9 and make them super popular. They were just in LA doing amazing LA things including like performing at like the UCLA like basketball game, which I was like, what the heck? I didn't think they could do, like I didn't think they were that big, but yeah, it was really cool. This now is NCT Universe. This is NCT's third album. It's too big. I can't fit it all in frame, but all that matters is Jamin not is right there because <laughs> he's my vice. This poster is so big. Oh my gosh. But this is the album right here. And I love this album. I'm obsessed with it. I love the concept. I love the packaging. I think that the sleeve is so cool, but that they took use of the like side stitch there because what it allows you to do, and by the way, this is like matte and then that's like shiny. It allows you to like open the pages all the way and it has just a really cool industrial feel to it. It's a very unique like album like physically i'm in love with the photo shoot too like the i mean the photo shoot is what sells it for me but the 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 packaging itself is so cool because yeah you can open it all the way and then at the back whoop, there's the disc yeah this is not an unboxing guys uh you'll have to go somewhere else to watch a proper unboxing but it's got these really cool um well i don't know like neo culture technology type things like like what is nct like this is this is what I fell in love with. I fell in love with, with the weird science and engineering aesthetic mixed in with the overly aggressive and also very soft and sweaty and exciting world of NCT and all of its subunits. So this is um, the album. It came with an individual poster, which is the whole group. And I think that's so nice. Minus, of course, the couple members that are currently not in it because they are on holiday or shooting or currently on a hold or on break and that's the insert from sm i got hendry sticker sheet and i got i believe this was shotaro and i got a jano photo card i was screaming the odds of getting one of the dreamies in this is so slim it's actually probably like one out of three but anyway i got one of the dreamies and that made this all definitely worth it so because i don't listen to like one two seven uh sorry i i just don't i have like one or two uh nct 127 albums on my phone but nothing like physically and the last k-pop like album type thing that i've got here besides like other things is a stray kids light stick <laughs> i have no explanation other than that i know they are going on tour this year and I will see them. I will see them. And I will make a video for this on its own. So there will be its own Stray Kids video. I'll unbox that later. The next thing I want to talk about is TXT merch because it all finally came in. This is Act Boy in Seoul. This was their, um, it's it, like it, comeback, but for like specifically for MOA type thing. And it came with this large print. I'll show you guys what I got. I'm just trying to go through the smaller things here. And then these were the cards that I have. So I got Subin, Subini, and I got Yeonjun. I got Bumgyu. Uh, I got Terry. I got Mr. Golden Boy. And I got Winning Kai as my special. So there's that. And I love the design here. And then here is my group card that I got. So these were all in this little thing i just did one i wasn't going to try to get all of them honestly it's just to get one for fun but what i did get was a towel and it, it seems so silly to get a towel but guys once they were wearing it and using it on stage i needed it so it just says act boy on it it's actually quite soft and so it's just a small like hand type towel you can use it for a variety of different things and i also got the t-shirt that they, all the members were wearing and I specifically bought this because I wanted to try doing the cutoff that they did. So like if you watch or if you remember it, they had like the sleeves cut off to a certain point and then around the neck they cut it off. And so I was like, oh my God, do I buy this like $50 shirt and attempt to do this? 
but I don't know, I might try it because it's literally just a white t-shirt otherwise. I have nothing to lose. And if it doesn't work out, well, <laughs> oops. But there it says Act Boy. And yeah, this concert was literally like a year ago. I don't know, it took me so long to get the merch, but it also took a long time to like get this video filmed. So next thing I wanna go over is some gift stuff that I got for the holidays. This was from my sister. This is BTS's Phila collab. This is the On, the On collab. And guys, I'm in love with this shirt. I've already actually worn it once. Eh, spoiler alert. That's why it has no tags. But no more dream. All in the fine stitching. And it is such a beautiful shirt. It's so simplistic, but so wonderful. And I I love it. There's also this little detail here of the dove. If I can get it to focus. But yeah. Uh, I love the shirt. And then I also got the jacket type thing because she decided to spoil me. I'm like, yo, you just dropped so much money. I I was honestly speechless when I saw this because I knew that she got one for herself and I was like honestly happy for her. But I was like, I can't spend the money at the time. And so I'm like, I'm not going to do it. And then she literally bought also for me and then saved it as a gift for Christmas. And so I'm eternally grateful and thankful to her still don't know how she got it but yeah and then on the back it says on and Phila. and i'm doing a horrible job showing off literally everything in this video but the other thing i wanted to show you shirt wise was this one it's tiny ton and it was from hot topic and they literally just had it on sale it was like only available in one size so i think it's pretty big but on the back it has all of the tiny ton characters so J-Hope, RM, Ooh, let me get it. There's Yoongi down there, Jimin's in the very bottom, V's right there, Jungkook, and Mabias, Jin in the center, as he should be. <laughs> so yeah, this is just a red t-shirt that I just like the design and I thought it was super fun to have. And going on to the last few things that I have here, these are all ATs related. So I wanted to group them all together. Yes, I saw ATs. Yes, I went to them in Dallas. Yes, I literally would cry because it was so amazing. This is the album, by the way. This is the Fever epilogue. Um, this is the diary version of it in this beautiful green. I actually don't love the album, and I'll talk about why very quickly. There's all the cards. Again, I, I'm doing a t terrible job at going through everything here, but the reason I don't like the album is because a lot of the shots in this book are horizontal shots. So the, the end of it, perfect. I love it, absolutely pristine. But you'll see here, there's a lot of this business going on where they did not put any room in the gutter. And so they're vertical though. So it, they just look, they look truncated and they look short. And that makes me really sad to see them so short like this. I'm still gonna keep it though. In fact, I might do some kind of customization artsy thing. You see lots of things like on TikTok these days of people doing like al album deconstruction. But these were my two photo cards. I got a Bias Records Songhua and Wu Young. And so, but yeah, the, the, the show was so good. It was incredible. I'll have my footage up here very soon of the show. This is the other version, by the way. I think I have it upside down. Yeah, this is the A version, which is, I love this version. This is my favorite, but I'll have my vlog up for it soon. I took a lot of videos. They're very bad videos, but at least I can say I was there. <laughs> like they're, they're my videos and it's not a vlog like I did for BTS. So it's nothing creative or fancy, but it'll just be all the footage compiled into one video. So I can always look back on it. By the way, that's crazy. And he's just as beautiful in person. All of them are literally Yoonho. Like I got to see Yeehaw with Yoonho and as a Midwesterner, this is a very big deal. So go check out my Instagram. Uh, I have it like linked below and you can see some of the photos I have and I'll keep like bringing some out as it goes along but yeah I was at the Dallas show on the 27th I'm so surprised I even made it there because uh, there was a like it was a, it was the connecting flight to Denver Airport and Denver was I guess all bad weather and so it literally got delayed like two hours and we were flying in the day of and the whole thing was just so much anxiety I don't know how it all worked out in the end, but I literally got in my seat, to my seat, like 45 minutes in advance. And people were just chilling and walking around like it was no big deal. And yeah, I was like, literally thank the stars. I don't know how everything worked out the way it was supposed to. But the next thing I wanna show you guys, I have to get it, is photo cards, AT's photo cards. And by the way, 
these were from the album. Well, okay, they're in a, I already have them in sleeves, but there's Hongjun, Songhua, Mingi, and I bought them like online, so the shop exclusive came with some, but it came with this Yoon Ho, which I took to the concert. He was saved in the back of my phone. I literally put him in my phone case, and then there's Mingi. I don't know how I keep getting lucky getting literally my favorite members of this group, but there's that. And then I got the, um, this dual photo card set. So my sister has the other one, and this is for Zero Fever Part 3, so it's kind of old, but it took forever to get in. Like, I didn't get it until like the last few days of December. But it's a whole photo card set, like a whole set. And it was only like 15 or $20. So I would definitely say it was worth it. And then this is an extra San photo card. So yes, Eternal Sunshine forever. I definitely have so much appreciation for that song, like even more than I did before because of the concert. But um, before I move on, this was already something I unboxed. This is the AT Seasons Greetings. You can go check out that unboxing if you'd like. I wanted to let you guys know that for the diary, I'm actually going to write in it because it seems like such a waste to not write in it, but I will be writing all of their activity. So I'm tracking everything in this planner. Maybe I'll try to post updates and videos or something or on my Instagram if you're curious, but I'm tracking basically every time they do a live on YouTube or a live somewhere. Um, obviously the world tour, release of videos, MV, milestones, you know, travel, that kind of stuff. I want to track ATs for a whole year and just fill this thing up. And so I'm hoping that by the end of it, I will be able to show you guys everywhere the ATs went and everything that they did. But the last things I want to show you guys were the concert merch because it's, uh, the concert was so amazing, guys. You have no idea. This is, uh, it needs to be lint rolled. It's so awful. But this is the shirt that I wore. So I bought this online in advance from the like merch that they were selling. And so this is just a t-shirt. It just says the fellowship on the back and it has the design. So this is what I wore at the concert. And what I was able to buy after the concert was this bracelet. And if it focuses, there we go. And it says the fellowship beginning of the end. And it took me till the end of the concert to literally realize that it's called beginning of the end because it's the end of the tour that got canceled like last year. So I was like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. This is just a little bag. It's just a small type bag, but I've got lots of little bags all over the place that I use to like just carry everywhere I go. So this is just always such a such a nifty thing to have. And then finally, oh my God, I'm literally crying because I have a shirt and I wasn't planning on standing in the merch line because I got there and I was like, you know what? We're lucky we're even here. We should just get to our seats even though they literally had merch. And I was like, yeah, we should do that. And then after the concert, we were waiting for like an Uber to come get us. And I was like, you know, what? let's just stand in the merch line and just see if we can, you know, how far we get. And if we don't get merch, no big deal. At least we tried. And we got out like in it, that line and out of it in like 15 minutes. It was crazy. So I also spent a ridiculous amount of money, but I got a t-shirt for my worries. We were in the Dallas show. Los Angeles is finishing up as I am filming this video, but Guys, that's everything. That is all I got for you. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'm sorry it's all over the place, but if you want to see more like individual things, just let me know in the comments or if you have any thoughts on any of this stuff, definitely let me know. And do you prefer individual unboxings or these like group mass type things where I just haul for the whole month? Definitely let me know in the comments. But until next time, 